There you go. Brought the goods. Wasn't easy to find this, you know. Went around every damn antique shop in the capital before we came across it. Yeah, and now my legs hurt like a bitch for it. I'm gonna hurt something fierce tomorrow. Well earned, I'm sure. Open the case so we can confirm its contents then. This does appear to be what the boss has asked for. It looks authentic to me, too. Uh, this ain't no knockoff. It's the real thing. So, we good for a million? And where did you pull that figure from? I believe we agreed on a hundred thousand Mira down, and three hundred thousand more upon completion of the job. Yeah, well, that was then, and this is now. Inflation ain't pretty, you feel me? Doesn't sound very fair that we busted our asses for something so important only for a little loose change. And there's a lot of rumors going around about you guys. How about it? You treat us right, and this could be the start of something real nice here. Huh. <laughs> Interesting. I suppose you do deserve a little extra something. The hell? You gotta be kidding me! You think we won't play? What, what is this? Huh. Should have known your place. Word to the wise. Don't try to blackmail someone higher up on the food chain. Damn it. The cops! When did they start patrolling down here? Idiots. Must have been on your tail. Let's just get out of... What? Where'd it go? I don't know any better than you! What are you doing down here? Here. We're done. Let's scram. We ain't gonna wait around to get busted, neither! <sighs> this wasn't how it's supposed to go! Suspects in sight! Seems that tip paid off. Apprehend them! Even those dumbasses in the police force have their uses once in a while. Things gotta be worth a shit ton of mirror if A wants it that bad. Guess I should check the Black Light District. Or maybe there would be a better place to start. Thanks for your patronage. I hope to see you again. Just you now. We're about to close for the day. Yeah, I hear you. Come on. Gotta take this upstairs, Humes.
go to bed then. Night night. Night night. Grandpa loves you. Good night, sweetie. Don't forget to brush your teeth first, all right? This one's on me, Van. <laughs> Thanks. These little perks are why they call you the diva of the diner, you know? <laughs> well, this diva is very welcome. Think you can butter her up, do ya? You really shouldn't enable him. Hmm. <laughs> I sure smell something brewing. And it ain't the coffee. Another dead end for me. Going above board for this is going to keep getting me nowhere fast. I think I'll have to take her advice after all. As bad as I feel exploiting loopholes in the law... Bingo. It was stolen from an antique shop in the capital last weekend, but because it could have been stolen goods, the shop never reported it. has trouble written all over it. I have no idea if this person even exists, but let's plug in that code she gave me. Oh, it worked after all!
Monmar. This looks like the building. What an adorable bistro this is. It has such a welcoming storefront. Is the place I'm looking for really right above here? Oh, are you a customer perhaps? It's still breakfast hours if you're interested. Or is it the office upstairs you're here for? It, it is the office, actually. Is this where I can find Arc Ride Solutions? That's right, he only just finished breakfast himself, so I'm sure you'll still find him in his office. He might have gone back to bed though, so don't be shy about knocking a few times to get his attention. doesn't get more complicated than mine. <sighs> First thing in the morning? job, right? I... I am! I have something I'd really like your help with, so if you don't mind, sir... Thank you very much. First, I'd like to tell you a little about myself. My name is Agnes Clodel. I currently attend a school in the Ober District. Our Miss Academy, yeah? Pretty famous school. Guess you're a first year student living in the dorms, Miss Clodell?
You're very well informed. Oh, was it my uniform that gave it away? You got it. Though I think anybody who lives in Edith would recognize it. Uh, the first year part's just my gut. You sure got the looks of a grown woman, but the way you carry yourself says it all. I beg your pardon? The name's Van. Van Arkride. Don't got a clue how you found out about me. But, if you know the 4SBG code, you gotta know what work I do here, right? I do. You're a contractor people go to when they have a job they feel uncomfortable discussing with the police or the guild. I'm told people often refer to you as a Spriggan. Close, but not quite. It's not just an issue of comfort. I take on jobs you flat out couldn't bring up to the authorities. Jobs so close to illegal, the cops hate me. You get that, right? Uh, I... I think so. Well, whatever. Just give me a rundown on what you want doing for starters. I'll decide whether to take it on after that. The 
Thank you. In that case... Holy shit! Don't tell me Aramis gives all new students Xyphas these days. Those things are top of the line. No, but... um... you're not far off. Please have a look at this. An antique pocket watch? Wait... This is what I want your help with. I'd like your assistance in locating the old orb mint in that image. It's a few decades old and a memento of a relative of mine. Um, my great-grandfather. Hmm. Where'd you get this image? It was... well, it wasn't through an ordinary search engine, I'll say that. Records indicate it was stolen from an antique shop in the city a week ago. I'm gonna assume you mean a special search app based on a P4 protocol exploit. Not what I was expecting. Um... I'll give it to you straight. Take this one of the cops or the guild. I don't know what kind of orbment this is, but it looks like it's got a whole lot of historical value. And you mentioned it was stolen. Likely some seedy folks are involved at this point. Besides, searching for a memento of a relative sounds like something those suckers at the guild would eat right up. S so you say, but... I can't. I just can't. I 
I can't go to the police with this. And the guild is even more out of the question. If you say so. Oh, I guess I should have put out something to eat with the tea, huh? Oh, speaking of food... This is from a popular cakery near our dorm. They only make 20 of them a day, and they're supposed to be really good. This is Andalusia's late summer limited time edition! Specially made tart covered in violette de soleil figs from Orid and Honey! You are something of an expert, I see. I just want to make this clear. I'm not doing this because I couldn't say no to that tart. Got it? If you say so.
Then I'm counting on you, Mr. Arkride. Same to you. Van's fine, by the way. If you're sure... Then why don't you call me Agnes? 